King Charles has announced his coronation date for May the 6th, a date that could prove troublesome for the newly ascended king. The ceremony will take place at Westminster Abbey, conducted by the Archbishop of Canterbury. The event is listed to take place on the same day as Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's eldest child, Archie Mountbatten Windsor, celebrates his birthday. A coronation service will see King Charles and Queen Consort Camilla formally crowned in a lavish service that will likely steal the spotlight away from the young Sussex family member. It is likely that King Charles could face the wrath of the Sussexes, especially if the coronation is seen as a snub from Archie's grandfather and the new King of England. One thing's for sure. Archie won't be getting a title as a birthday gift. Royal fans think it's a smart move by King Charles. If Harry is refusing to let Charles see his grandchildren, he'll have to stay away from the event. Harry and Meghan would look pretty shitty if they leave Archie home with nannies for his birthday. While some see this move as an attack on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, others believe it's King Charles' move to hold out an olive branch. Reportedly, the Sussex squad are furious as the ceremony will coincide with Archie's fourth birthday. One Twitter user, at Iris the Scholar, wrote, so King Charles, the cruel has set his coronation for the 6th of May next year, aka his grandson Prince Archie of Sussex's fourth birthday. Another nicknamed H, or HRH Pluggles, questioned, is the King's coronation date the same as Archie's birthday deliberately? Meanwhile, at Jennifer E. Watts wrote, Royalists freak out when the Sussexes release a picture two days after the rest of the family, or does anything when a birthday pic of the Cambridge kids is released, saying it overshadows them, but by all means, schedule your coronation on Archie's birthday. The audacity. At Music 2, Patrice added, Hmm, it is strange that the coronation is on Prince Archie's birthday. But another user, at Amaya Rua 1, suggested that the coronation date may have been an olive branch to the Sussexes. She explained, Coronation day is Archie's birthday too. That for me symbolises that although the royal family is an institution, family will always be family. I hope it's an olive branch from father to son, and King to Prince. At Sister Anne One added, the coronation of King Charles III and Queen Camilla will take place on May the 6th, 2023, the birthday of Archie. Great move, your majesty. Tensions are already running rampant between the Sussexes and members of the royal family, who are said to be hugely nervous about the upcoming release of Prince Harry's memoir. One royal expert has suggested the fractured relationship between the Sussexes and members of the firm could be on the mend in the near future. It all depends, however, on how well received both Prince Harry's memoir and the upcoming Netflix show are, and how they portray the other members of the royal family. Author Tina Brown said, They're now in this bind, where they've taken all this money and Harry has made this book deal where he's supposed to spill everything about his horrible life as a royal, but now he's actually tortured about it because he understands there's no way back if he does. If the book continues, I don't think there's any way for Harry to return, so my view has always been that the book won't see the light of day. The window is beginning to close, but I always thought at some point a deal would be made and Charles would have to pay back the advance to stop Harry writing the book. Those revisions will likely not include any new lines on the impact of his father's coronation on that of his eldest child's birthday, as the book is likely to be released some months beforehand. But a planned reconciliation could be off the cards, should the king find himself snubbing the young royal's birthday bash.